Okay, I may be completely wrong in this one, but I think I think there is a mistake in Stranger Things season 4. Hear me out and please, please feel free to correct me if I'm wrong in the comment section. I would really love to do that because this kind of a mistake is really scratching my head big time and I could really use your help to just put that matter to rest. But anyways, let's start with the mistake. So up until the third episode, we know two things that Vecna is killing people and Vecna has killed two people. And now we have seen season four. So we now in hindsight, you can look at season four with a different lens. And now that we know Vecna was going to kill four people and all of the four people would have the same characteristics like they would have nightmares. They would have really bad nightmares about their past, about their past traumas. Then they would have headaches, node bleeds, and uh, they would also have some vision but the most important thing is that they would see a grandfather clock and after that within 24 hours they'll die but this specific information about they'll die within 24 hours after seeing the grandfather clock is the main point of debate here in this video so now let's go back to the third episode right at the end so at the end of the third episode we see that max along with dustin steve they go to miss kelly's office and miss kelly is the same miss kelly who is the therapist so they go at hawkins high and they go at miss kelly's office right at night and there they figure out that actually chrissy and fred both who died before both visited miss kelly for help and Max was also going to Miss Kelly for help as well. And there they figured out that both Chrissy and Fred were having nightmares, they were having headaches, they were having nose bleeds, and the exact same thing was happening to Max as well. And they also got to know that Chrissy had been having all of these things for a week, Fred had them for six days, and Max was having them for five days. And then suddenly Max was put into a trance by Vecna, and she was shown the grandfather clock, and then cut! The episode ends and we get into episode 4. And then right at the start of episode 4, Max explains everything to others. Like how Chrissy and Fred were having headaches, they were having cold sweat, they were having nightmares, they were also seeing things, they were seeing bad things from their past, from their past traumas, and their visions actually got worse and worse and worse, and then finally, they died. But here she specifically mentions that both of them, Fred and Chrissy, died after their first vision. But that's the point. How does she know that? And she also says that I just saw that goddamn clock. And she says that I don't know how long I have to live, but I just saw that goddamn clock. That really means that after seeing the grandfather clock, you would die within 24 hours. But how does she know that? Because this information specifically that after seeing the grandfather clock, you die within 24 hours wasn't conveyed to Miss Kelly at all because let's back up and go back to the first and second episode. In the first episode we see Chrissy actually goes into the woods to buy drugs from Eddie. There is the first time where she sees the grandfather clock and then she goes to Eddie's trailer and then she eventually dies. But between going into Eddie's trailer and going into the woods where she first saw the clock, in between that there was no chance of that information of that she has seen the grandfather clock to actually convey to anyone. Forget Miss Kelly. No one actually knows other than Chrissy that she has seen the grandfather clock. Same goes with Fred as well because at the end of the second episode we see when Nancy was actually talking to Eddie's uncle. Simultaneously we see the scene where Fred actually sees the grandfather clock for the first time and just moments later he dies. So again there was no chance of that information of you die within 24 hours after you see the grandfather clock to actually travel to any other living soul. I mean that's the thing here because how can Max be so sure after seeing the grandfather clock you will die within 24 hours. There is literally no way logical way for anyone to have this information. Well, this is exactly the point where I am actually fixating on that how does Max know that and here is where I need your help because please go back and watch the first, second and third episodes and please help me figure out whether there is really a mistake in that scene or not. I highly recommend you to watch this playlist because this is the playlist in which I upload a new video every Sunday in which I discuss everything that has happened in the filming of Stranger Things season 5 in the past week. Like if you don't know, let me tell you, Stranger Things season 5 filming is underway. It's been underway for 13 weeks and we have actually entered the 14 week. So please check that playlist out as well. And as always, thank you so much for watching.